good to go here. All right. I think, I think we're on. Yes. We just good to go here. Yep, we're good. Okay. Uh, can you see? Oh, shoot. Did I do this wrong? Yeah. No, I did it correctly. I did it correctly. Okay. Yeah, here we are, everybody. Tony D, Little Joan, for the birthday stream. Oh, the only thing I have to set up is how I can see your comments. So, i got to set that up. How do I do that? That's an excellent question, Tony D. Uh, let me go to my page. i got to be able to see my own dang questions. Here we go. We'll go to the live stream. That's, uh, there we go. And we'll do that. And we'll shrink that. And we'll do... Hold on. <laughs> i got too many things going on at once. Oh, I know what i got to do. i got to pull this out. Okay, we'll pull this out over there. And we'll do this. We'll go back to the game. I'm playing Rogue. And then pull this up. And then. And then. See if we can get. Where are the comments? Okay, there are the comments there. I want. Okay. I'll have to do it this way. I'll have to do it this way, little John. Oh. Hold on. Hold on, little Joan. There we go. I'll have to. Oh, sorry. That's the wrong one, too. This is the one we want. I want this totally full. And then, put this here. And we'll cover up this. Okay. Now I can see your comments. They're on the right. So, if you have any comments, I know it's a surprise live stream. We'll see if we get anybody, little Joan. It's my birthday. So, we're just going to have some fun and forget our troubles with Rogue. Okay. Tony D is my name. Now, for those of you who have never played Rogue, as you can see, the monsters are letters of the alphabet. And that is a Kestrel. And I'm going to throw. This is how you shoot arrows, by the way. I'm going to throw. I'd have to switch to the short bow to get a bonus, but I'm just going to throw them. Okay. Okay, Kestrel's dead. All right, this is my first guy. I have never finished this game uh, in the history of having the game. And I've had the game since the 80s. And in fact, when I went to... I have it in my computer, but I couldn't get it to, to work. Uh, the copy. So uh, I found this site. This, um, what is this? Myabandonedware.com <laughs> game. So it has the, uh, the entire game here. I've never completed it. it Here's how it works. You're an adventurer. You're going through different levels. Oh, there's an emu. I'm going to beat him. Okay. And you fight the letters of the alphabet. E is for emu, by the way. And they get increasingly tough. So it's just like Dungeons and Dragons. And then you go up on levels. That's the steps that go down. They only go down. And what you're doing is you have to get to level 26 to get a magic amulet that will allow you to go upstairs. Which I've gotten the amulet. And as I was trying to go upstairs, I ended up falling in the traps that put me downstairs. And that was very unfortunate. Because I've only acquired the amulet, I think, two or three times in all the times i played this game. And I've been playing this game for, let's see, almost 40 years. No, oh, come on, die. Okay, there we go. All right, nope. He's coming. I'm going to have to kill him. All right. So we're going to throw at the hobgoblin. We're going to throw arrows. Oops. And then you can hit A to repeat. Okay. It's best to defeat guys from a distance if you can. Now, in upper levels, the rooms get dark, so you can only see a certain distance. I know, John. It's very exciting. Um, so you can see my little happy face there, my guy running around. But it's very random, so that's why I've never completed the game. Um, because when I did get the amulet and I could go up, I uh, I kept falling down trap doors. And the hardest the hardest monster in the game is by far the dragon. The dragon is very tough. You see him, 
uh, you just got to run, or if you got a uh, one of the magic wands, can kill him by turning him into a different monster. That's the wand of polymorphing. That's the ice monster there. Eyes for ice monster. You have to eat food in this game, Joe. It's a mango. So, the little, the little red symbol. Now, with the ice monster, the hard thing is. I'm going to throw stuff because I don't want to take a risk here. Um, if, you, if you get hit by the ice monster, you get frozen. Oh, he moved. Never mind. I forgot he did move. Yeah, so you just have to defeat him. All right, I'm level three. So I'm at 20 hit points. I'm doing okay. Again, random hit points. Sometimes you only gain one. Okay, we get that. We got some potions. Now, at some point, I'm going to fill up with too much food and stuff. And I'm going to have to start... Uh, trying out the potions, which is always risky, because you can go blind. There is a blind potion, Joan. Are you bored already, Joan? I mean, this is an exciting game. I don't know why you don't like it. I know. You you don't remember this game. This is before your time, little dog. Way before your time. So, uh, and then to wait, you can hit the uh, period button. There we go. Let the snake get next to me so I can hit him. If you step in in a space where, like, the monster, the monsters are always going after you. So if you if you if if they go diagonally and move the same time you do, I gotta move this cursor out of my way. Um, you know, see, they get the extra they get the extra space and get the hit hit an extra time, which is always a problem if you're trying to run away. So I got some good hit points this game. I, I played a few warm-up games to get me going here. All right, so we're done with this level. And you want to try, you want to clear every level as best you can, especially early on, to accumulate a much, as much stuff as possible. And right now, I'm really just had to run this gauntlet because I've lost some hit points. Oh, damn, I lost more. And you want to get them back. So going down. Oh, there's a dark room now. See, now this is where it changes. Now it's, it's starting to get dark dark rooms. There's the steps. Okay. You want to check all the rooms for doors. So there's only one door on a wall. You can't have two. Not in this. Not this is the 80s. You can't have two doors. That's too much graphics. Too much. Don't need it. Back in my day, we didn't need extra doors. See that? There's no rooms above it. Oh, the orc. Oh, he's tough. The orcs always run for the gold. So he was on top of the gold. All right, now I'm getting hungry. Now you could go, there's a little trick to the game. You can get uh, hungrier. So wait until you get weak. Now, now at upper levels, you've got to be careful because if you get too weak, you can start passing out. Now, i got plenty of food, so. But I'm just trying to let, make my food uh, last. I know, Joe. It's, a, it's uh, I know, you think I'm playing it too fast, but this is the way I play the game. They're early levels, John. We're not into the nitty-gritty yet. Okay, some armor. That's the symbol for armor, everybody. Ring man. Well, that's not very good. But later on in the game, we'll be getting to rust monsters, and they eat your armor. Uh, they're represented by the letter R. Okay, and then we're done with this place. Okay, time to get out of here, Joan. Okay, uh-oh. Hobgoblin, there we go. All right, so now we're, we're kicking A and taking names, Joan. We are taken. There we go. Okay. And down a level. So this is what we did for video games. All right, I'm dead center in this map, as you can see. Oh, I fainted. Oh, shoot. Got to eat the food. I forgot to eat food. Hey, eat. Okay, now I'm good. Whoo, that was close, Joan. Shouldn't have done that. All right. Let's uh, check my inventory here. All right, I got three rations of food, a mango, a scroll, with a made-up crazy name, a vermilion potion, an accrue potion, an extra suit of ring mail, uh, and my equipment, which is ring mail, mace, short bow, some arrows. It's a little too early to use the scrolls, I think. So let's uh, keep going before... I haven't really gotten a lot of magic items, which is problematic. Okay, there was a secret passage there. You search the secret passage by hitting the S button. Alright, here's a potion. Ok, 
Okay, that's better. Gold potion. Joan's very excited by this game. Oh, let's search. There we go. Okay. Now it's getting harder to find rooms. They're getting dark and they're, they're getting harder to find. Here's another scroll. Oh, okay, we got two scrolls. Now, a little trick to the game. If you get two scrolls, it's often an identify scroll. Because identify. Ooh, plate mail. Oh, we're going to put that on. All right, so we're going to take off plate mail and we're going to wear or take off my ring mail and put on the plate mail. Ooh, that's good plate. Look at that. Armor class 8. No one's going to hit me for a while. Until we get to rust monsters, then they... Oh, yeah, there's a rattlesnake. Now, rattlesnakes are bad because they zap your strength. Okay, that's good. Uh, that's, this was a good pickup, John. Plate mail. And it wasn't even cursed. You can get cursed plate mail. Oh, yeah, there's cursed items in the game. Okay, there's that. All right, a scroll. And you can get scrolls that uh, give bonuses to your armor, too. So that would be nice. Ooh, we're getting a lot of scrolls now. All right. Yes, John. I know it is exciting. Okay. There's nothing in that room. There's an emu. He ain't gonna touch me. It's not in my plate now. I am rocking it. Oh, there we go. Three scrolls. Okay, let's see. We got a doorway up here. We do not. Okay, let's go downstairs. Alright. And is there no room down here? No. Once in a while they throw you on a loop there. Look at all the walking I'm doing, Joe. Right, there might be a secret passage here, so I'm going to check. No, doesn't appear to me. There are magic rings in the game. Oh! Hey, how you doing, Don? Welcome to the birthday, uh, birthday, surprise birthday, uh, live stream. And I'm playing Rogue, 80s classic. Uh, everybody does video game, uh, What's the names? Video game streams. Oh man, I gotta find the secret passage now. See, there's a room. This is very old school. This is like it's it says 1984, but in my computer it was saved in the 1980s. Uh, 1980. So I don't even think I had a computer that old. Um, so I think it's 84. I definitely had a computer by 84. Before then, I don't know. Oh, I could leave. There might not be a room. Eh, screw it. I'm not going to search. That's, it eats up all your food. So, um, yeah. Just kicking it old school. Just relaxing. Joan got her hair cut today. Here, let's show off Joan. What are you barking at? Look at little Joan. She got her hair cut. Isn't that nice? <laughs> all right. You happy? What do you need? Oh, we finally got somebody to stop in and say hi, and you're gonna just like abandon me. All right, yeah, back in the 80s, we didn't need any graphics, Don. Uh, Don says, dude, you can play a lot of old games for free now. It's called an emulator, if you haven't heard. This is way before my time, <laughs> yeah, it's before everybody's time. What's an emulator? Is that like a it's not, is it one of those like stand up arcade dealies where it has like 10 games in it? Or is that like a program that I'm missing out on? Oh, there's the orc. Ran right into him. I'm level 5, dude. I'm level 5. I'm kicking it. I am. Oh no, I ran into the leprechaun. Oh, he steals your gold. Oh, I have to kill him. Oh, fortunately, I got to play. Oh, he hit me. Oh, my gold. Oh, he stole 400 gold pieces. That's a disaster. Because you're raided by gold. Ah, oh, I ran into him in the dark. Oh. oh, that was a mistake. Rookie mistake. Damn, leprechauns. Ah, oh, I should have backed off. I'm not paying attention. Get out of here, you emu. All right, Joe. You want to go? You're going to miss the whole live stream. This is very exciting. Uh, no, nah, man, you literally go on a website and download the game in, in its original ROM. Oh, that's cool. I'll have to check that out. They have them for all the consoles, even PS2. Wow. 
the hell am I saving my PS2 for then? Um, I think I have a PS2, or do I have a PS3? Well, maybe it's a 3. I don't know. I haven't played, played in ages. I went with the Xbox when it was time. Or rather, my ex did. My ex bought me that Xbox. Because she spent too much money in my view. Um, all right, now found this. Still fighting hobgoblins. There we go. This is how we gamed in the old days, Don. That sounds cool, though. I'll have to check that out. I just don't have time for video games anymore. Yeah, it is nice to play the original console. I mean, I still have my Xbox, and I never play it. And I got a copy of uh, uh, Red Dead Redemption 2, but I should be playing that. <laughs> but, I don't know. These games, the old school games, they require so much, or the new school games, they require so much time commitment. You know, it's like... How much time commitment do I want to devote to a game? It's like, no, I can go either way here. Joan, shut up. The only thing that I don't have on this one is my old keyboard used to be able to go diagonally, and I can't do diagonally in this. Oh, shit. A whole room full of monsters. Okay. I guess, uh, I don't know. I guess it was just those two. There's a centaur in here. They're tough. They're tough. Oh, I'm weak. I better eat some food. I need some food. Okay, there we go. Okay, time to shoot some arrows. Shooting arrows. Shooting arrows. Ah, defeated. Okay, let's see, let's see if I get any treasure from him. Nope, I just wasted a bunch of arrows and I killed an innocent centaur. Um, you still have your original console. You still have a PS2, I assume. But, oh, there's another centaur in here. I should leave these guys alone. All right. Oh, rattlesnake. No! He zapped my strength. Grabbing sushi on the way home and birthday tradition. Nice! That's the way to do it. I had my sushi yesterday. It was delicious. I went to O Sushi in Marlton. Jesus. I gotta drink some potions now. Alright, so let's quaff. Hopefully I get a, a restore potion. Restore strength one. Let's just go in order here. For a million. Okay, that was healing. Alright, that's not bad. Quaff. Ecru potion. I'm moving faster. Okay, well that's this potion of speed. And quaff. Gold potion can't move, I can move again. Okay. Let us uh, kill this centaur. Can't leave any can't leave anything alive, Don. Um, yeah, my sushi place is uh, Oh Sushi in Marlton. It's fantastic. Metal Gear Solid. He says, Tony, I think you should check out Metal Gear Solid. May have heard of it before. I think I have heard of that before. How did I, how did I miss this guy? Oh, I slowed down. Now the centaur is coming after me. Ah, nuts. Okay, I killed him anyway. Alright, got my arrows. I'm running out of arrows, though. The story is really cool. I've heard good things about Metal Gear Solid. I'll tell you who plays video games. Man, that Razor Fist. I don't know where that when that dude has time to do anything other than play video games. That guy plays video games. I thought I was good at video games until I watched him play. Jesus. Alright, Hobgoblin. Alright, I'm level 6 now. I'm having a good game, though. I know, Joe. Hey, look. The story of Rogue is a good one. It's about a little guy who's just a face <laughs> who runs around on dots. Oh, defeated an orc. Man, a lot of monsters on this level. All right, Joan, I'm going to let you down because I don't want to hear you bark anymore. All right, say goodbye to Joan. All right, little dog. Here you go. Totally shaved dog. Uh, okay. Strange white mist envelops you and you fall asleep. Oh, no. 
Ah, and I'm up awake again. Ah, oh, that's one of the traps. Don't like those traps. You hit that trap on the up, uh, the bottom levels, you are screwed. I've always looked at him as a gamer and didn't find out about his political commentary until later, actually. Yeah. Well, a friend of mine actually turned me on to him because of, uh, I think, one of his movie reviews. Um, yep, and his movie reviews. And uh, my friend, who is very, uh, shall we say, liberal, would not agree with Racer's politics at all. So it's kind of uh, funny that he... Uh, ended up telling me about um, Razor. Because um, after, you know, he really enjoyed Razor's commentary, but like that's where it ended for him. Now he's like, no, I don't watch, he doesn't watch Razor anymore. Which I think is a shame. So many people are close-minded to other political views. I think it's an indication of the weakness of their views. Oh man, my strength's still down to 13, but I got good armor, so I got a shot at this, Don. I do. I'm on level 8. I've got 18 more levels to go if I can get powerful enough, but I'm going to need to fix my strength. And that ain't gonna, that is, that's sometimes tough to do in this game. My hit points are good. Hit points are solid. Armor's great. Once I get to the rust monsters, that may be a bit of a problem. Oh, good. There's another potion. I'm going to drink the potion when I get down to the next level. Because one of the potions is uh, detect magic. Oh, let's kill this guy. I want to have to fight him on the way out. Okay. So let's make sure this room is empty. Okay. Dude, I don't know how you guys got through games back then. <laughs> now I I can just look up to a guide. I know. I don't think there's a guide for Rogue, though, because I think it's totally random. Right, let me quaff a potion here. Gray potion, let's see. The gray potion is... Ah, it's gain strength, but I need restore strength. Angry video game nerd makes me glad I was born when I was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I used to dream of the games that are out now, you know? We used to play these games and like, oh, man. Uh, you know, back when... Uh, There's another game I used to love called uh, Venture. It was an arcade game. It was very similar. It was the guy's little... Oh, no, here it is. I gotta take off my armor. The Rust Monster. He injured my armor, damn it. Now I gotta put it back on. Oh, my arm is messed up now. Thanks a lot, Rust Monster. Oh, he's represented by an A. I forgot. Okay, now the damn rattlesnake's here. How's the guy still hit me? I got plate mail on. Jesus. Now my strength is down to 12. Jesus, I gotta get my strength back. or we're... I am screwed here without that strength. Oh, boy. I'm in trouble. Gotta get some damn potions. Now I'm hungry. Oh, man, it's all room full of monsters. No, well, can't. No, well, maybe just two? Oh, here's a potion. Oh, I can't carry anything else. Oh, time to read a scroll. Let's read. Let's read the identify scroll. Okay, I can identify one item. Uh, I guess I'm going to identify one of the other scrolls, because that's all I got. I don't have any other magic items, so let's identify the last one. I. Scroll of Enchant Weapon. Okay. I think I'm going to hold on to that until I find a sword. Um, let's drink this potion. Cloth Magenta Potion. Oh, level up. All right. I got a level up potion. All right. Let's search for secret passages. I don't care. Let's go down another level. I just gained a level. Oh, another potion. Okay. Kill this guy. All right, time to drink this potion, white potion. Okay, det detect monster. He is down there. That was the ice monster. 
Um, yeah, we didn't ha even have any sound effects with this. Ooh, eat food. I detect monster though. What a waste of waste of uh, potion that is. Oh, there's the leprechaun! Hooray! Now I can get my gold back. Okay. Die, leprechaun, die. Yay! Because when you kill the leprechaun, you get his gold. Oh no, it's a quagga. They're tough. Unfortunately, I got this armor on. Jesus. I'm in trouble. Oh, whew. All right, things are getting tight. Things are getting tight here. I'm at level 10. It's all down to the strength potion. If I could just get a better strength going, I got a shot at this. Oh, here we go. Two, two hobgoblins in the same room. I feel like if I was your age back then, I'd be stoned and playing this. Yeah, that's pretty much, the graphics wouldn't bother me. <laughs> that's, that's pretty much what everybody did back then, except me. Uh, usually it was all about getting stoned. Reminds me of a funny story. Uh, my mother wanted me to go to an, a, ch uh, a church group. Oh, no. Ah, oh, the nymph. The nymph hitches. She steals a magic item. She stole my old armor. That bitch. Um, so anyway, my mother wanted me to go to this church group, right? And I was like, okay, I, I guess. I didn't really want to go, but I said I would. I figured, you know, we'd sit around, talk about the Bible or whatever. So it's just a bunch of dudes, random dudes. And they're all around my age, a little older. And all they talked about was drinking beer, getting high, getting girls. And I just thought, wow, this is a, kind of a weird church group. It's not very churchy. <laughs> and that was the last time I went. They smoked through the whole thing, too. Yeah, damn witch is right. It's the nymph. It's the nymph, Don. Beware of the N. N stands for nymphs. Ah, oh, damn, another quagga. Okay, so I'm going to try. Oh, shit. I got to get out of here. All right. And I am running down the stairs to get away from those guys. Whew. I'm going to have a problem coming back up if I, if I manage to get the magic amulet that allows me to go back up. I'm going to have to fight those two guys on the way out. Yeah, exactly. That's what I said. And then when I got home, I told my mother, and she's like, Ow, you're lying. And I'm just like, I'm not lying. You sent me to a church group for crying out loud. Okay, Crimson Potion. All right. Oh, Yeti. Let's see if I can beat him weak, little weak arms. You guys really had to raise hell back then, though. No phones or internet. Well, we did have phones. We just had, uh, oh, damn it, mango juice. That's not a magic potion. Um, we had, and I, I explained this to my nephew, who's, uh, who's like, how old is he now? I guess he's like 20. So, Phones were a thing back in my day. Back in my day, they were in, in a building. So you had to go to a, a place to use a phone. Oh, shit. Stupid rust monster. Ah, oh, he weakened my armor. The one thing I got going for me. I got to put it back on. So you had to go to, you know, a building. Somebody's house. You know, if you were out, you'd be like, you couldn't say, can I borrow your phone? You'd be like, uh, can we go go to some place where there was a phone? Oh, damn, another rust monster. Oh, this armor's getting beat to hell. Okay, wear the armor. All right, now I got a choice. Do I wear the ring mail or the plate mail? The ring mail should be four unless it's cursed. Oh, no, it's plus three. Plus three ring mail, Don. We're back in business here with a armor rating of seven. All right. That was a good, good uh, lucky pull there. 
So, uh, yeah, you'd have to go to a place. Right? Ah, stupid armor-eating bastard. Die, die. Okay, at least he can't injure me. Okay, put it back on. Uh, yeah, there's chain mail in it, too. Ooh, that was a rattlesnake. Jeez, just when I need to lose more strength. Yeah, exactly. It's uh, ring mail is one step down. I think chain mail is five in this game. Oh, I'm in a bear trap. Get me out of there. Okay. Really need a potion to fix my strength. Oh, shoot. Centaur. Get the hell out of here. Oh, this is bad. Now I'm trapped between the quagga, quagga and the centaur. Ah. <sighs> So, here are my options. I could read a random scroll, or I can continue to fight. Jeez. I'm unlikely to win this battle, but let's see. I scored an excellent hit on the Quagga, down to 27. I'm from the generation B4 smartphones. Man, it's weird. I missed the Quagga. Oh, double hits. All right, I might have to read a poet. Let me read... See if I get a teleport scroll here. I'm going to read the next scroll. Scroll is blank. I will call it blank. And it doesn't seem to help my situation. Yeah, I'm going to read another scroll. Read this scroll. Oh, it's got a map. That ain't going to help me. Ah, I'm dead. Dead. See? Look at the <laughs> look at the year. The year is 1980 to 1983. Killed by a centaur. Oh, all right. Well, that was a pretty good game. Oh, man. All right. That was Tony D number number two. We'll call this guy Tony D number three. Uh, at least they. That was the biggest graphic in the game. That tombstone. Man, all I got in that game was armor. Oh, that was lame. Kill this bat. For one experience point, I'll kill the bat. Oh, here we go. Mr. Hobgoblin again. Come on. All right. Killed him. Scroll. Killed that guy. That's a Kestrel. K. Okay. All right. Get some gold. I kind of messed up that game anyway when the leprechaun hit me. God, that was a rookie mistake. Oh, Pile Goblin again. Okay, now I'm level two, 19 hit points. All right, we're, we're working it. Tetris, man. This is like Elden Ring, but back then, <laughs> that's kind of crazy. <laughs> right, you know, Elden Ring, there'd be all these bells and whistles. This is nice and simple. This is why I like uh, Doom. Uh, short bow. Ooh, okay. It's level one. It's nice and simple. I I like simple in in the way of games. You know. Don't get me wrong. I mean, some of these games are great. Fallout. I love Fallout, but this game I killed the ice monster. This game, uh, I guess, it just brings me back. This was like college for me. Yes. Yes, Doom. Oh, man. Look at all these bats. I can kill these bats. I don't like to be so emotionally invested in my character, too. And what really sucks in some of these games is when, uh, well, it used to be more of a problem back in the day, not so much now. It's like when you're in a game and you have to keep doing the same thing over and over again to get past a certain point. I just want to be past it after a certain point. I'm bored with it. See, this this game, man, this don't this don't help you at all. you got to figure it out. you got to get lucky. I mean, the only reason I got the amulet the few times I did was because I got lucky. I just ran, at, literally towards the end, I was trying to run out of the friggin' dungeon. I, 
I had the amulet, and I was just running. Well, might as well kill you. Alright, level four. I'm doing pretty good this game. This is, uh, I'm at 35 hit points. I haven't lost any strength yet. Oh, there's that guy. Kestrel. Ooh, a ring. Okay. Oh, another ring. Two rings. Alright, now, now we're... Yeah. Uh, what's the name? What's that uh, iPad game? Uh, it's all the all the walls and bullshit. <laughs> Especially when it comes to leveling up. Uh, what the hell's that game? Clash of Clans. I played that for a while. But man, that just... That's all about that freemium BS, right? It's all about, like, trying to get you to spend money. Can you imagine spending money on this game? <laughs> What a waste of money it would be. Oh man, another ring. They're giving away rings like candy in this version. See, I made the mistake last game. I got jammed up before I got to use all my magic. So this game, I can't make that mistake. Oh, now I'm hungry. I'm having a good game though. Last game I had three identify scrolls. This game I definitely don't have that, but I got three rings to identify, of course. Rings you gotta be careful on. You get a cursed one in this, you're stuck with it. It's really hard to get off unless you get a remove curse. And then uh had a ton of scrolls last game. Now this game I got a few. Better eat some food. Eat food. Okay. Food tastes awful. Alright. Oh, there's some armor. Slim mail. Oh, that's good armor. I think I'm going to put this on. Okay, there's that. Alright. Let's take off and wear. Split mail. Plus seven. Alright. Alright, got better armor again. This should be the stairs. Oh, you. Oh, no, that's an orc. Kill him. All right, there's the stairs. All right, that's it for this level. Okay. Let's see. I have three rings, two scrolls, three clear potions. Hmm. I should drink one. I'm going to drink a potion. So if this is a potion of increased strength... That could be very good. Oh, it's healing. Well, that's pretty good. All right, let's try reading the scroll. Read the scroll. Summon monster. Don't want that scroll. Good thing I read that here. And let's read the other scroll. E. Oh, map. Okay. All right. That wasn't a waste. So now I can see all the rooms. Check them out. There's the gold. Another scroll. Oh, want that. Oh, magic wand. Holy staff. Okay. Uh, you know, games are really grindy when, especially when it comes to leveling up. Yeah. Yeah, I hate that. Um, I don't know. I just want to have fun in these games. There's another scroll. I'm gonna have to read some scrolls next level. Kestrel, die, snake. Okay, level five. We're at 44 hit points, Don. Another Kestrel, kill him. Suit of armor, scale mail. That's not bad. It's better than the ring mail I started with. Okay, let's read the next two scrolls. Armor. Oh, yeah. Armor plus. Okay, now I got better armor. Read. Scroll. Identify scroll, exactly what I needed. Okay, let's identify the rings are the hardest. Let's do the ring. Ring of plus one dexterity. Okay, so let's put on the ring. Put it on my right hand. Now we got the dexterity ring. Yeah. 
now we're getting somewhere. We're only at level six, too. The only problem with some of these rings is they eat up your food. Okay, hit the zombie. All right, good. Oh, we got some more potions. Two green potions. Let's quaff one of these. Oh, no. Wrong button. Hit shift Q. That ends the game. All right, let's... Oh, restore. Okay, restore strength. I got a restore... I got two restore strength potions. So now... Yeah, I don't know how it I don't know how it's even rated in this game. Like in Dungeons and Dragons, it was a no-brainer, you knew that, but in this game, I don't know. I don't think you have a dexterity rating that I'm aware of. You can't like really see your character in this game, but strength is 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 right on here. Oh, damn it, I fell through a trap. Did you see that? So much for my dexterity. Ugh. My dexterity put me right down in the next level. All right. Well, can't uh, worry about that. Okay, secret passage. There we go. There's the steps. Oh, what did I get up? What did I get there? Crossbow bolts. Oh, that's a good one. Okay, now I got too much stuff. Uh, let's try drinking a potion, I guess. Let's drink... Uh, Let's drink the last potion, orange potion. Oh, I sense the presence of magic on this level. Okay, let's go get that magic. There's only one magic item, so this will be a short level. Okay, let's eat some food, because I need... Okay, I got another potion of restore strength. I am set for that. I could have used this last game, but all right. Should I even bother with these rooms for the gold? I guess I could. Golden experience. All right. Let's get back to the steps. God, what a news day today. I did the news and it's just... Pfft, what a freaking mess. Alright, nothing else in this level. I, I don't care about any of this. Alright, let's go. Hobgoblin. Die, 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 die. There we go. Oh, man. Down to 16 hit points. I gotta be more careful. Ah, oh, I fell in another trap. Jesus! Now I'm on level nine. I'm getting up there. I gotta watch myself. I'm getting down there, I should say. You go down in this game. All right. There's the orc. Kill him. Not quite at the level. The the, the first level gets really tough. It's the one with the trolls. That that's ooh. The trolls are very tough. Man, don't get me started on the news. Yeah, it's bad. Sometimes it feels like fake headlines out of a movie. Yeah, did you see? Um, did you see the one they compared? Oh no! Oh no! The armor thing. They compared the headlines from uh, uh, not the headlines. They they compared the um, oh what was it in uh, oh, stupid rattlesnake? All right, first I got to put back my armor. And then I'm going to have to drink my potion of restore strength because I got two of them. There we go. Now I got my strength back. So F you, Rattlesnake. I appreciate the news blast. I watch pretty much every day now. Oh, you're welcome. But yeah, today was just, it was so depressing and awful. And uh, anyhow, they had that, uh, you probably saw it on my news blast where uh, they compared the prices in uh, I Am Legend prices now because in I Am Legend, Will Smith's at the end of the world. Snakes are no joke. Yeah. <laughs> um, so in I Am Legend, you know, it's the end of the world. Ah, this freaking rattlesnake. Oh, how do you keep hitting me? Oh, no, you're going to eat my armor. Uh, armor. Jesus. They compare, uh, you know, the world ends and gas was... Uh, 690 a gallon when it ended and 
there's, there's a picture of that in the background of a shot of, you know, in the Will Smith movie. And I remember seeing that going, oh my God, imagine gas that high. And now here we are. We used to see all these movies in the 80s that were, oops, take off my armor. All these movies in the 80s were all about this dystopian future where news was censored. Yeah, the worst part is they're going to get higher. You're absolutely right. They're going to get way higher. I think they're. I think we're going to ten dollars a gallon. Not not soon, but eventually. Um, we're we're going to be European prices. It's going to be like, ooh, there's the leprechaun. Ooh, he's going to be tough to kill. Okay, let's throw an arrow at him. Uh, throw a crossbow ball. Oh shit, I missed him. All right, let's try to get away. Oh, he stole my gold again. Damn, leprechauns. Escape from New York in real life. Yeah. Oh, I remember that movie. Um, that's what that's what New York City is now. It, it is Escape from New York. It's crazy. Oh, a quagga. Okay, now, am I ready for this? Yeah, I can take you. I can take this quagga. Die, die. Okay. All right, I, too much stuff. I got to eat something or drink something or... Yeah, let's, uh, hmm, what do I drink? Do I drink the Restore Potion? I'll tell you what, I'll drink one of the other potions just to see what it is. H. Cloak of Darkness. Okay, we can't have that. That's the Blindness Potion. But fortunately, I have Potions of Healing. Boom. Okay. So that was a perfect time to drink that if you're going to drink a Blindness Potion. Stupid Potion. Oh, let's build a Blindness Potion, said the wizard. People will love that. Oh, there's a nymph. I'm going to kill you. But this time, I'll be across the room. Okay. Throwing crossbow bolts. And killing the nymph. I'm going to get my magic item back. Got a potion. Okay. Take it. Personally, my favorite apocalypse movie is Terminator 2. Yes. Great movie. It's bizarre to me that James Cameron went on to b make Avatar a terrible movie, in my view. Oh, Centaur. Die already, will you? Whew, there's a battle here. Oh, shoot. Okay. Now I'm weak. I better eat some food. All right. What did I do to that Centaur that he just attacks me like that? Um, ooh, there's a wand. Let's see. I got too much stuff. Hmm. Let's try drinking another potion. Ooh, okay, that was a potion of strength. Now I'm back to my regular strength. All right. Okay. Um, Avatar just... I don't get Avatar. It's so derivative. And it just wasn't that good. I mean, the effects were cool. Oh, no. Stupid quaggas. Oh no. Woo! Level 7. Just made it. Even the new Terminators don't hold up. Yeah, oh yeah, that. The female Terminator? I mean, what was that? What was that? Seriously? You woke idiots in Hollywood? Okay. I think I'm done with this level. Um, surprised they haven't rebooted again. Yeah, I think they would if they could. I mean, you know, I saw the one with Christian Bale, and even that was not great. And it's like, what the hell are you doing? Why, who who wants to see this? Oh, that. Oh, is that an orc? Oh, thank God, it was an orc. I thought it was a dragon. Oh, I'd have been dead. I mean, at least the one with Christian Bale was watchable. Wokenator. Yeah, exactly. Okay, killed the Yeti. Alright, waiting for a troll to show up. Oh, here's another Yeti.
Yeti, of course, represented by the letter Y. Never mind that there's no snow in the dungeon. Okay. Really need some more scrolls at this point. Okay, there's a way out. Okay, and the orc. Oh, shit! I hit the leprechaun again. All right, that time he only took a little bit of gold. All right, let's see. I've got a scroll here. That's exactly what I need. I may have to drop something. What am I going to drop? Robocop reboot was better, not as violent, though. Yeah, there's another movie that didn't really need to be rebooted. Let's try drinking a potion to get it out of here. I'll drink that. Can't move. Okay, now I can move again. Uh, okay, that's a random scroll. We'll just hold on to that. Wait till I get to the next level. All right. Zombie. Uh oh, I fell asleep. Oh, hit it. <laughs> Sleep trap. Damn. This dexterity does nothing for me. Okay. Let's read. Teleport scroll. Oh, look at that. Did you see that? I teleported from there to over there. Which actually was kind of useful because, uh,. I would have had to search that whole room for a secret passage. That would have taken forever. Oh, shit. Damn quater. Die. Okay. Let me put the armor back on. Uh, and I'm going to go back to the ring mail. Scale mail's all beat up now. Oh, here's a zombie. Kill you. Uh, centaur. Down to 27. Okay. Let's do this. I better drink this potion of healing. Okay. Whew. Kind of wasted that potion, but better safe than sorry, I guess. There's a leprechaun. All right, chance to get a little payback here. Okay, still missing him. All right, defeated the leprechaun. Time to get my arrows and the gold. Oh, that was a lot of gold. I think it was like 700 gold pieces. It's a lot for this game. I'm at 1,948 gold pieces. That's pretty good for this game. Ah, damn quagga. Okay. Starting to take on the quaggas now. Potion, two potions of restore strength. How did my strength get down to 14? Well, I can drink one of these. Jesus. Ah. Stupid centaur's back. Whew. Okay. It's getting rough down here on level 12. It's getting rough. Ah, damn it. Take off my armor again. Ah, damage my armor. Wear my armor. Okay. Scale mail time. Okay, back to level 5 armor. Scale mail is at 5. I'm over 2,000 gold pieces. I think I want to go to the next level. I'm not going to search for secret passages. That just takes up too much time. Oh, here's a scroll. Starting to get hungry. Need some food. Let's read this scroll. Ooh, Mace gives off a flash of bright light. What do I want to call it? I'll call it Dragon Slayer, but it could be anything Slayer. It picks a random letter from the alphabet, and that is the. it gives you a bonus on your weapon to slay that. And if you come across that that um, uh, monster, the the uh, the mace glows, and then you can automatically destroy. Oh, here's a wraith. They're tough. They're tough. I'm gonna have to uh, try to kill this guy. All right. Right, I killed them. Yeah, I don't want to leave those guys alive. 
They are tough. Alright, now I gotta search for a secret passage. None there. None there, alright. Oops, hit a trap. Oh, here it is, the troll. Oh no, okay. What do we got here? I do have some staffs, so if I do get into trouble, I could attempt to zap him. Oh boy, it's going to be tough to kill the troll. I'll tell you right now. Oh my god, I defeated him. Fantastic. All right. That was a big win. That was a big win. You don't know how tough those trolls are. That was a huge, huge win. All right, I got to watch my ass now. I'm on level 13 here. We're halfway through this. Okay, we'll kill you. We're halfway through this. This could be... Could I finally finish this game is the question. I'm definitely getting on the scoreboard here. Oh, I hit the nymph. Damn it. Just die already. Yes! Ooh, that was lucky. Okay, leather armor. Now, the advantage of leather armor, especially if it's magic... Oh, no! Oh, no! It's the wraith. Gotta kill him. Woo. Took my level and I got it back. Um, so now things are getting real. Oh, there's another wraith. I don't want to fight him. I'm just going to run away from him. I don't need to lose another level. Searching for a secret passage. Jeez, this level is like... Uh, here's a quagga. Okay. Now, if I was... If I had some of the better magic items, I'd make a run for it and just go down. But I need a few more items to... Oh, there's one. Okay, another staff. Oh, shit. Friggin' troll. Alright, now I'm in trouble. Okay. I got two... No, I got one, two, three staffs. I have no idea what they do. Alright, time to use a staff. Before I run out of hit points. We're going to zap in that direction with the first staff, a uh, holly staff. Okay, he still hit me. I'm going to try swinging at him. Barely missed a troll. He's injured me. Zap again. Oh, which direction? Towards the troll. I'm going to zap with... Troll scored an excellent hit on me. Okay, we're going to zap in that direction. The last one. Troll has injured me. Oh no. Ah, I'm dead. Nuts. Nuts. That was a good run. That was a good run. I'm at, uh, I rank number four on that one. Rank number four. Damn. Damn. All right. Tony D, the fourth. Here we go. That wasn't too bad. I'm getting back into the swing of things. Earthbound. What's Earthbound? Is that, uh, what era would that be? Is that the era of graphics? <laughs> and sound? I don't know. I don't know if I can handle graphics and sound. It's an RPG? Like pen and paper RPG? Thank you. Alright. There's a snake. Whew. Getting tough already. Leather armor. Okay. Food. Alright. Picking up some good things. Oh, a hobgoblin. Just die already. Okay. Level 2. Alright. Got a lot of hit points. Alright. It's all random. That's the problem with the game. Everything's random. Alright back. Oh, really? So it's like this? It's all oh, Super Nintendo. Okay. Super Nintendo. I used to have a Super Nintendo. It was pretty good. I, I have to say. There was an Aliens game on it. It was good. It had a Robocop game, though. That was terrible. Oh, the RoboCop game was the worst. 
I have a friend that plays all the time and he's your age? Oh. I'll tell you, you've never seen anything like that E.T. game. Jesus, that was awful. And uh, the funniest thing was the neighbor, my neighbor got it. He had an Atari. Like His family had some money and so we, we, me and my brother had like square bowling, which was like this really chintzy video game system. I forget who made it, but um, it was like the dumbest game. Square bowling was the best game on it. And uh, you would literally use square shapes and bowl against little other squares and um, it would just beep. That's all. And it had Pong, you know. Uh. <laughs> yeah, Don's laughing. It had Pong and uh, it had Biorhythm where you'd punch in your birthday and then uh, you punched in like the day's date and it would give you your biorhythm which would just it would just beep for like 20 minutes and then uh, not 20 but it would just beep for a ridiculously long period of time as if it was calculating something and then it would just have these square sort of graphs and then you're supposed to look into a book and that it told you what the graphs meant I know about that game from an angry video game nerd really wow he must cover everything The other thing I was thinking of doing for this live stream was uh, mine, uh, Minesweeper. <laughs> but I'm really terrible at Minesweeper. And I, you can't find it anymore. I guess you got to find it online. But, God, you know what I really want to get? I may go to your, 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 the site you recommended just to get it. It's friggin' regular Solitaire. Windows puts in Solitaire, but it's like some ridiculous Solitaire game where you have to, like, hook up to the internet and it gives you stats and then every once in a while it plays a commercial. It's like, you already had this frigging game. It was the greatest game you made. It was just a simple solitaire game. And then you had to go junk it all up with all these bells and whistles nobody asked for. Oh, great. You need a secret passage. I know. You can't, you can't improve upon a classic. Oh, good. I found that quick. Yeah, they're perfectly functional. Well, but like, you know, Microsoft wasn't making enough money now that they figured out they got to they got to screw everybody every 10 seconds, I guess. Put everybody on subscriptions. Oh, crap. I may have screwed myself here. Uh, one hit point. I'm in trouble. Oh, wow. Wow. That was close. Whoo. All right, let's take a breather here. Let me check. Uh, uh, better read something or drink something. So let's let's quaff a potion. Quaff. Oh, potion of confusion. I'll let that wear off. Okay. And then pink potion. All right, potion of healing. That's exactly what I needed. I'll tell you a game I really love to play now. And you can now play it online. It's Terraforming Mars. Uh, it's not an old game either. Oh, shit. Rattlesnake. Damn it. Oh, I missed him. Ah, oh, he's going he's gonna to eat my strength. Damn it. Um, yep, can't even play online on Xbox without subscription. Yeah, it's so dumb. I mean, you can, but... Like, half the games are meant to be played online. Yeah. Yeah, PC Master Race, as they say, eh? I used to play uh, Unreal Tournament online. That was my PC, PC game. Uh, that was uh, a little more modern. What was that, the early 2000s, I guess? Uh, Unreal Tournament, you'd get to, um, it was kind of like Doom. Uh, no, I am not stuck. 
I am stuck at the secret passage because I don't want to walk around. My hands are getting tired, though. These games used to make your hands tired. Oops, wrong button. Okay. Let's read some scrolls. Let's read. Ooh. Blue glow. Okay, my mace is enchanted. I'm going to enchant it again. Might as well. Read another scroll. Nothing happened. I might be invisible, though. They don't tell you when you're invisible. If you turn invisible. That was uh, like Quake 2. I know about that one. Always seemed fun. Yeah, it was great. Um, the classic moment in real tournament was the sniper position because there was a, one of the mazes was a, or a bunch of the mazes were space stations. So one of the space stations had this giant, I don't know what you'd call it, like a needle or something. And you'd go out all the way out on the needle. But you had to be careful because you could fall off of it. And it, was, it, it got increasingly thinner as you walked out on it. And uh, so if you could get out pretty far in the needle, almost no one could see you. And, and you had the view of most of the maze because it was like kind of out in the open. And then you could pick off people. But of course, if somebody realized you were out on that needle, you were screwed because, ah, stupid rattlesnake. Um, all right. Got leather armor. So, there we go. In this room for nothing. Uh, okay. All the way out here for some gold. Big deal. I'm down to 13 strength. That's not good. Gotta get my strength back up. Oh, shit. Two emus. Friggin' emus. It's like the only monster they could think of um, that began with E. Emu. Alright, let's get you. Alright, let's drink a potion. We have any potions? Damn it. Got any scrolls? We'll read a scroll. Let's see. Summon monster. Again. Good thing I read it now. Oops. Trap. Oh, here we go. Another scroll. Two scrolls. R, C. Ooh, red. She has. This is a scroll of slay the next monster you hit. be a big monster. Yeah, guess he is on him. Alright, my hands are now done glowing red. Alright. I want to search for a secret passage. I'll search here, but I'm not walking all the way around. Whew, getting tired. Getting tired. A level seven. Alright, need a sip. Ah, oh, this takes me back. Need some M&Ms and some uh, Doritos. All right. I'm going to kill this leprechaun. Die, 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 die. Oh, shit. Oh, hit him on the last. Whew, okay. I'm going to pick up some gold here. Let's see. I got 1,018. Ah, big deal. Big deal. 60 gold pieces? What, are you kidding me? Uh, poor le poor ass leprechaun. Ah, the rattlesnake. Damn it. I gotta get some more potion. Down to 13 strength. That's not good. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'll tell you what games I used to like, because I used to be an arcade guy. 
Because, you know, in my day, that was the only game in town. Uh, Berserk. Yeah, these enemies get... I didn't even get to the super tough ones. Oh, there's the... Uh, there's the Leprechaun. All right. First, I'm going to read this scroll. E. And then I'm going to throw arrows at the leprechaun. Okay, defeated. Let's see how much gold I get. We're at 1208. 1219. 11 gold pieces. What are you kidding me? Oh, plate mail. Hold on. Let's take that off. And where? Plate mail. All right. Get out of here, you stupid bat. Worst thing about the bats is, oops, centaur. I'll go around him. I'll just steal your gold and leave that guy alone. Okay, nothing in there. Stupid bats. Oop. Oh man, monsters are everywhere all of a sudden. Ooh, I nearly got surrounded. Arcades are a blast. Yes, they are, Don. Um, my friend had one. It was an arcade of one kind of dealy where you got like five or six games in, in one uh, stand-up unit. Had Time Pilot, which I always love. Don says, I've always wanted to have a mushroom trip at one. <laughs> I'm noticing a pattern with you, Don. I'm noticing a pattern. Alright, let's see. Centaur, not moving. Good. Just stay asleep. We don't need to fight you, Mr. Centaur. Okay. Actually, I should probably kill you for the experience, but... There's only one left around you. Yeah, I, I couldn't tell you where an arcade was left around me. Up at college, we used to have one... Uh, we used to have a great one. Uh, it was at the bus depot. And it was all old games, like really old games. Like the first one, it had asteroids and space invaders and um, the old Star Wars game. Oh, that's what, that's one of my favorites, the old Star Wars game. A friend of mine bought it, bought one one time, and he used to uh, have it in his apartment in Philadelphia. I would go over to his house and we'd play Star Wars. Oh, come on. Right, getting off of this level. Okay, let's eat food first, though. Weak. Okay. Snake. Die. Alright, I'm on level 9. Alright. Oh, here's a whole room full of monsters. Now this... This only happens, I don't know how often in this game, but the deal is it's full of monsters means it's full of treasure. So this is very key. So if I kill this Quagga, he would probably be the hardest guy. Ever played Battlefront 2? Um, which one is that? I know I did a review. Oh, shit. It's the one with the armor. I gotta take off my armor. I gotta put on. I'm gonna put on the leather armor because oh, I put on cursed armor. Damn it! All right, why well, I'm fighting the armor eater? Uh, sorry. I gotta see if there's anything to read here. Uh, let's read this. An identify scroll. Oh, I'm in, I'm in trouble here. Let's identify this wand. Wand of striking. Okay. Um. Best Star Wars game ever. Oh, Star Wars Battlefront 2. No, I haven't played that one. Um, let's see. What can I do here? I'm going to read another scroll. So I need to remove curse. Nose tingles a sense of food. Okay, detect food and eat. Remove curse. 
Okay, now I can take off this armor and put on different leather armor, which I'm also going to risk. Okay, now I'm going to wear the leather armor to fight. Ah, uh, now I got a fucking rattlesnake. Oh, lucky, he's dead. Oh, uh, now the fucking nymph. All right, I'm going to have to use the magic item to kill her. So I'm going to use the wand of striking. And I'm going to do it again. Because if I don't, she could end up stealing it. Okay, defeated the nymph. All right. We're, oh, man, they're all going down one after another, one after another. Oh, my God, they're all dead. Okay. Now i got to take off my armor and put on the plate mail. Okay, now I'm going into the room. This is the old way. The old way is, the old one, one is way better, PS2. Um, oh, I got another monster here. All right, now I'm, I'm, I'm collecting the spoils. All right, so, so far we got a scroll, we got food, we got a potion. Got arrows. Now let's back up and kill this rattlesnake. I don't need this. I need to lose any more strength. Okay, good. Potion. Oh, more strength. Or more uh, rattlesnake. Let's see. Gonna throw arrows. Defeat it. All right. Oh, can't carry anything else. All right, time to quaff some potions. Oh, Cloak of Darkness. Don't want that. Got to quaff some more potions. Feel stronger. Wrong potion. Oh, now there's poison. Now I'm sick. Uh, better pick up this potion. More skillful. Shoot. I really messed myself up. Oh, now I'm blind. Great. Great. I'm blind with no damn potions. I gotta stumble around until I find, uh, until I find, I don't even know what I'm fighting now. Great. Walking around blind in a dungeon. Not good. Oh, here we go. Hopefully I'm going to find a potion soon. Ah, uh, uh, teleport trap. Man. This is brutal. This is absolutely brutal. Oh, shit. Armor eater. Gotta put the armor back on. <sighs> Jay. Alright. Let's go back up here. Uh, fight, fight, fighting something. Something injured me. What that is. Okay, found the door. Oh man. Twenty-four gold pieces. All right. Let's see what I could drop here. Oh, let's drop the cursed leather armor. And now I got a short bow. Great. Just what I need. Just what a blind man needs. A short bow, Don. Ah, oh, this sucks. Ah, oh, now I gotta fight blind. I'm, I'm still winning, though. Are you winning, son? <laughs> oh, man. That would be the ultimate if I finished this game blind. I don't know how I would. I'd have to stumble upon the necklace. step on the teleport trap. Save myself some walking. Alright, time to go downstairs blind. Oh, there's 
it. Okay, let's see. Can I read scrolls like this? Identity scroll. Okay, I will identify what? I got a scroll. Enchant armor. Okay. Another scroll of identify. Handy. Need some more magic items, though. Um, hmm. Shit. Weakening my armor. Okay. Back on the armor. Really need that potion of healing. Badly. Alright. Found the way out. This level. I gotta feel around for a doorway because I can't see it. Damn it. Alright, gotta go back to this room. See if there's a doorway here. Oh! It wore off! Hooray! Ah, shit. Centaur. Okay. Alright, things are looking up. Uh, I have to call you back later. See if there's anything in my inventory I can drop. Uh, let's drop a short bow. I got too many of them. Ten darts. Uh, that's better than a short bow. Still could use a... Oh, damn it. Fell into a trap. Take off my armor. He's eating my armor, damn it. Okay, wear my armor again. All right. Plate mail is down to four, so that is useless because what I can do is I can put on leather armor and then read enchant armor. And now I'm at le level four and I don't care about anything uh, like plate mail armor now because that's only going to get destroyed by the armor eater thing. An aquator. What is an aquator? I never heard of that. Ray Charles, yeah. Ray Charles on an adventure. Ooh, I killed the nymph. I ran right into her. Scroll of Enchant Armor. There we go. Read that. Okay, now I got plus two. Plus two leather. That is very good. Now I could drop the other armor, which is also five. That's my old armor. I'm going to drop the leather armor. And I guess I might as well drop my old armor too. Uh, it's useless. Gotta gotta make tough choices in a dungeon world. Okay. Go down here. Killed the ice monster. One of the wands, which I haven't found in a while, is a light wand. And uh, the light wand, you go into one of these, oh, damn it, the rattlesnake. You go into a room that's dark and you zap and boom, you can see the whole room. Which is very handy if you find one of those room full of monster rooms. <clears throat> All right. Oh, no. Oh, wait. I don't care about that. I don't care about the armor eater anymore. However, my strength is down to nothing. Down to, down to 9 from 16. That's not good. I need more potions. Do I have any? No. I got no damn potions. Everything's good except my strength. Time to get out of here. Oh, there's a Yeti. Whew. So far, so good. The magic's really saved me in this game. 
I didn't have all these magic items. If I didn't have this magic weapon, I'd already been dead. Let's kill this Yeti. 60 hit points. Level 12. I'm at level 8 experience. Oh, a ring! That's what we need, baby. Oh, yeah. Let's read that identify scroll and see what this ring is. Hopefully, it's good. Best ring in the game is regeneration. Plus one ring of strength. Oh, let's put that on. Because we are, we are hurting for strength. Okay. So now my strength is 10. Thanks to all the magic, I'm, I'm merely a moderate weakling. As opposed to an incredible weakling. Oops. Oh, it's centaurs. I'm taking out, taking out these monsters better than before. I'll tell you that. All right. I'm not searching the whole wall for a secret passage here. Too much. Let's go back to where there's a door. Ah, scroll of identify. Okay. I could just get my strength back. Oh, I'd be dangerous. Quagga. Okay, kill the quagga. Okay, I don't have to worry about the armor eater. Kill him. Oh, there's a wand. Oh, time to read. Read a scroll of identity. Ooh, all right. We're in the big leagues now, Don. We're in the big leagues. I got a wand of polymorph. And what that means is when I get in trouble with a monster, I could turn it into another monster. But it's totally random. But the thing is, once you're at a high level and you're uh, doing that, you encounter a dragon and you zap it with a wand of polymorph, it could turn into a bat and then you're good. It could also just turn into something worse, but it's nothing much worse than a dragon. So, oh, here's the armor eater. Goodbye. Armor eater again. Don't have to worry about you guys this game. Aha! I don't know how guys play games like Razor Fist and talk about politics. It's so distracting to be, even just this game. Oh, what did I step on? Some kind of trap. You know, it's hard to concentrate on the game. Oh no, I'm in the crypt. This is the crypt, by the way. Oh no, a wraith. Oh, die wraith. Oh boy, I'm in trouble. He's, uh, I've lost the level. See, I lost two levels, and you kill the wraith, you get, automatically get one back, but now I'm down a level. Oof, that, that was costly. That was costly. What level am I on? 13. So 13, we're starting to get into troll territory. Leprechaun, shit. Ooh, I got lucky there. He's dead for 85 gold pieces. For 85 gold pieces, he might as well have given me his gold. Joke. 85 gold pieces. Oh, I'm going to have to go back through the crypt to get to the rest of this thing. There's a zombie, okay. There's usually nothing in the crypt anyway. Ugh, oh, rattlesnake. Just die already. Whew. Armor eater. Okay. Some gold. Get you. The trolls, I know. Oh. Fell asleep. That's a worse. You hit a trap and then you're just done. Fall asleep and trolls come get you. Poof. Come on. Uh, armor eater. Core. All right, screw this level. I'm out. Oh, potion. Definitely need that. Okay, I'm drinking it right away. At this point, we've hit all the bad potions just about. Ah, restore. We've done it. Restore strength. Ah, my strength is 17 now. Ha ha. Suck it, monsters. 
Oh, this could be the game. Could this be the game after all these years? Oh, baby. Studded leather armor. I don't need you. Might as well drop you in the next room. The only other thing I gotta worry about is running out of food. Let's see, what's my food situation? Five rations. I'm in, I'm in okay shape. This armor, because I don't need it. Uh, studded leather. H, goodbye. Yeah, doing pretty good here. I mean, the Wanda Polymorph, that's a big one. Alright, let's uh, see if I can kill this nymph. Scroll of Identify, that's always good. Quagga, kill him, no problem now. Scroll called Blank. I'm not sure what this scroll does. It's sometimes an invisibility spell, but no, no other monster was in the room when I read it, so... I'm not even sure what the hell it is, then. I guess I could identify it. Sure, I want to waste it though. All right, now I need a secret passage. Get out of my way, monsters! Studded leather, I don't need. Jeez, I gotta search half this dungeon just to find a way out now. Whew. That took forever. Oh no. Don't want that wraith. Great. I'm not fighting that wraith. Not after last time. Man, I went through a thing of food already. Alright, there's the steps. Good, more food. Oh, two foods. Okay. Let's just get out of here. Okay. Let us read the identity scroll and see what this ring is. Ring of Maintain Armor. Well, we don't need that now. But I'll hold on to it. Short bow. Picked up that. There's the steps. Eat some food. Alright. Go with Quagga. Four thousand one hundred seventy-five gold pieces. Doing well on the gold. We're at level fifteen. It means I got eleven, eleven levels to go. Level twenty-six because it's letters of the alphabet is where the amulet is. I have a shot with the wand of polymorph, but it's a it's a distant shot because the other thing you need is the best uh, ring, which is oh, the ring of regeneration. That, that'll that almost guarantee that you are able to uh, defeat defeat most monsters. The Ring of Regeneration, you're just going to keep getting your hit points back. But you burn through food, of course, very quickly. I think I'm burning through a little extra food with this. Uh, oh, I think this is a room full of monsters. I'm seeing a lot of treasure. Okay, oh, look at this. Okay, oh, yeah, let's back out. Okay, so we gotta kill that Yeti. And then another Yeti. And then the Nymph. Let me throw something down the hall. Oh, a Phantom. Oh, Phantoms are tough. 
can't see the phantom. That's a problem. Whew. All right. Oh, wow. This is, this is where we're getting into the nitty-gritty. This is called an Urval. So I may have to zap him with the Wanda Polymorph. Hmm. Ha. <sighs> Question is, do I do it now? Well, let's try hitting him once. He missed. He injured me. Uh, I'm going to have to zap him now. All right. Big play here. Wanda Polymorph. Hopefully he turns into something less than a than a Erval. And nothing happened. Okay, that's not good. All right. We could try to run for the entrance, though. I'm out of here. Boom. That's going to be a problem if we do find the amulet and come back this way, but we'll see. Oh, no. Venus flytrap. I'm stuck. Whew. Okay. Yeah, see, we're way up there now. Venus flytrap and uh, Irviles. Let's see what I got here. I think I got a, a new staff to identify, so let's do that. Staff of Light. Oh, this will very, be very handy. If I had known that in the other one, I would have used it. Okay. See, watch. I'll show you. Staff of Life. Okay. Ta-da! <laughs> I know, right? This is the most impressive thing in the game. It's the little things, Don. It's the little things that get you all excited when you're playing a game like this. It's like, wow, I can see a I can see a whole light? I can see a whole room now? Oh, another Irva. Oh no, come on! Oh Jesus! Just like that. Just like that. It's over. The game's screwing me over. You damn right it screwed me over. Jesus. Oh my god. Now I remember why I'd stopped playing this game. God, that I was I was on such a roll. What do you think? Should I go one more? Should I go one more? I know. I know. Well I was injured. I had to walk around to gain hit points. I should have used I should have used the light wand on that room. That would have been the room. Damn it. All right, I'm going to go one more game. All right, this will be the last game. Let's see if I can burn through. Tony D5. Right, we're just going to do this do this the old school way. And watch me. I'm going to do like a speed run. Ah! See? See? Oh, that, that, that one doesn't count. We'll do... Well, that, that one doesn't count. Can't go that fast. <laughs> All right. I won't go quite that fast. Speed runs a little too much. All right. See, the hobgoblins are really tough at this level. All right. One, this, this is the last game. Supposed to return a phone call too. What time is it? Oh my God! It's ten thirty at night. Look at what I'm doing. It's like I'm eighteen again. Stupid bat! Die bat! That was a speed run. Yeah, yeah. Speed run on. I didn't even get past level one. Me and my brother used to play this game all the damn time. Oh, man. I'm down to two hit points. I could die. All right. Let's pick up this wand. Let's see. Do we have any scrolls? I'm going to read a scroll if I have one. Yeah. Oh. Armor. Okay. Magic armor. Kind of wasted it on the uh, ring mail, but this early should help me.
my brother and I both like to play games. Oh shit. I am about to die again. Come on. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> uh, all right. All right. I'm going to end it here. Uh, as that was heartbreaking. Heartbreaking, Don. What was my highest score? Third. Third. Tony D4 got the third place. With three... 3,893 gold pieces. I needed 8,311 gold pieces to get second and over 14,739 to get first. Well, that's just crazy. Yeah, I definitely have to get to level 26 to get that kind of money. Get that kind of money. All right. Well, thanks for joining me for my birthday uh, 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 stream. I know it was. I know it was a surprise. I wish I could have scheduled it, but I, I wasn't even sure I was going to do it. Quite frankly, it's my birthday, and crazy. I got to get on Facebook and thank everybody for their well wishes. Thank you, Don, for joining me, and uh, <laughs> and uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, don't forget the l Sunday live stream on uh, Sunday at two. I don't. Uh, I don't got nothing going on in my life, so sure. Definitely doing that, and uh, we'll see you.